Without the visibility of failure, research can just not exist. And the built environment normally has the big limitation that it's extremely averse uh, to risk. Practice and research are very close to each other. And this is also why our contribution is titled Research as Architecture. Nest is a house for houses. So it's a big infrastructure built for other houses which are experimental, so research, to be built in reality and experienced and demonstrated and discussed and criticized. Nest allows to reduce the costs or the risks of experimentation. The building is already there, so you just add a little part on top of it and there you can test materials, systems, whatever you want. So if you fail, the amount you risk is uh, dramatically reduced. And this should give an incentive to academia, to industry and to policymaker to test things. In regard to this big very interesting question of how we will live together. We will have to look into more flexible, incomplete, uh, fragmentary ways to build and to rearrange the build environment. The risk is that it will be too late. So it's all about accelerating these things and this needs a new architectural culture that is willing to take these risks Innovation is not so much about isolated inventions or technologies, but it's about a cultural development. Building, historically, is a cultural operation. The built environment, beyond the single object, is an operation that includes everybody. So it includes society, includes politics, includes all kinds of stakeholders. And if they are not in sync, if they do not have a, a common understanding, both of the challenges and the possible solutions, then these things will not really be fruitful. We very much like to propagate this term of new digital building culture because it makes implicitly the statement that it cannot be just my work, but it's a common process.